what is your name and what are your personal accomplishments and other person personal information okay i'm tim garcia um i graduated from university of the philippines in 1999 took up um Studio arts painting, I'm a BFA. Um, I've had two solo shows so far. Um, I have one coming up in July. Uh, I don't remember how many group shows I've had with other artists, but that's pretty much it. <laughs> uh, who are you as an artist and what do you do? Um, I work primarily as a painter, meaning I still do traditional painting on canvas works, but sometimes I do installation art, which is sculptural and three-dimensional in nature. And I also do, um, right now I venture into multimedia and mixed media works because um, I want to evolve in my art making. Um, what, who am I? I am still actually trying to figure that out, even at my age, because I really am trying to come up with the most honest work I can produce as an artist. Mm. If ever you have clients, what services can you offer to them? Um, I've had people approach me for portraits, for um, special works, commissioned works, like in my high school, St. Teresa's College. Um, I had to come up with designs for our homecoming merchandise. So I, you know, I, I get, I try to get what is needed, like nostalgia, sentimentality, you know, the sense of history, and I try to incorporate that into the artwork. But for the most part, since I am represented by a gallery, um, I actually don't know who my clients are, the ones who buy my work. Um, I would like every somebody buys my work or likes it. It's because they found something in my paintings that resonate with them, and not because I painted something that I would hope would sell. Mm. If ever, if there is a client, what do you think you can you can handle them? How can you handle them, if ever? How do I handle the clients? Yes. Um, I would have to talk to them face to face. Like, um, if somebody wants me to do a portrait, or if somebody wants me to do a mural in their restaurant, which I did before, um, I would really have to talk to them and ask what um, what they really want. I would want to explain my style and. I do want to show my portfolio if they find something I've done before that they want to reflect on the on the piece that they want me to produce then it's easier for us to arrive at you know a study that they will have to approve. Um, I really try to communicate well with my my clients, with my audience before I execute the work because I don't like revisions. For you, what are the important characteristics of an artist should have? Number one is honesty. Because there are a lot of trends in the art scene that, you know, artists want to sell works. But um, if you just keep following the trends, like uso ngayon ang um, street art, or uso ngayon ang um, murals. But you don't do that, and you still want to follow because you want to sell you are what we call selling out and not in the best way because it's okay for people to buy your work but if you are honest you are only going to paint because you have something to say and you want to let the audience know what it is you want to say by painting or by sculpture or by anything and not because you know you paint because hey this will get me so and so money.
Very good. 1970 graduated, pero I'm uh, high school hindi ako married no? college na. I started painting late May after my custom pass. That was 1999. When he passed away, depressed ako. So, nag-ano ako ng workshop. So, parang therapy. So, I was blessed na yung teacher ko, my teacher ko sa workshop. He was the one who said, he told me, Join ka ng competition. Siyempre, when you join a workshop, it's just a hobby. Then say, ah, hobby ko lang yan eh. No, you never know until you give it a try. So he brought me to a gallery na the owner loves watercolor. Because sabi niya, yung watercolor ko maganda. I'll be there. So when I went there, uh, the owner said, Siyempre sa workshop, maligod lang eh, di ba? Normally, you don't paint big ones, sabi niya. Okay, we come back next year kasi sarado na. It's invitational competition. It's not open to just anyone. They screen your work. If they like your work, that's the time na they'll invite you to join. So, sabi niya, next year, mag-paint ka na malaki. One more sheet. So, that's what I did. Following year, mag-paint ako. Sabi niya, sige, pasado ka na. I'll invite you. Runner up ako. Following year. And then from then on, the little na, the, the owner said, you bring your painting, you can sign with me. So every year when they have competition, I'm invited, so I'm going to join the home. Last year, after the gallery, the closing gallery, so last year they revived the competition. So last year, I won again. I, actually, I won three times top five twice run it up. So after I won last year, I was elevated to Hall of Fame. So, making Hall of Fame right now is a, it's a what they call a competition. Here are some of my work. This was one of my first pieces that won the what they call it. What they call it? Watercolor din ito. Uh, after I painted the mga candles, I painted the series colors with it so far. So, um, ito. Ito, rather, up. Watercolor din. This is acrylic. Kasi, umpisa ko, watercolor. Then, si Fidel Sarmiento sa Pia Marge. Ah, perfect ka mag-acrylic. Kasi, every time, may, may, joint exhibit kami yung sa Korea. Sabi niya, ayaw nilang watercolor. Kasi watercolor, kailangan may glass. Kung walang glass, kakainin niya ng pieces ka lang. So sabi niya, they don't want me, they don't want us to bring watercolor. Mukhang ito ka. Oo. So, they, so he told me, wag ano ka, try ng appeal. So this is my first piece of appeal. Get appeal. Acrylic, acrylic. No, this is what uh, acrylic also. Itong piece ko, this was uh, Manila art. Manila art is a, uh, parang it's an art fair where maraming galleries na ganon sila sa kanila. Where, where many galleries na ganon, nagkumpol-kumpol sila. Then they hold exhibition. First two years, maganda. May mga foreigners, collectors, and everything. Pero lately, hindi na, not as prestigious as the one that they, that's been held in Ayala. Pero pwede na rin. So this was one of my things. Yan, really. Watercolor. Parang totoo po. No, realistic na po eh. Photographic. Feeling. Feeling. These are all, yeah, watercolor. Ano na-try nyo na-try sa oil? I cannot paint oil dahil 
I need you to go. Wow, wow. You get sick. You have to stick in the film so I'm going to go. I've known quite a few artists in my time. I don't know how to do it. I don't know how to do it. Just, just to give you an idea, it's acrylic, acrylic, watercolor, watercolor, acrylic, watercolor, 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 acrylic. Natry nyo po yung ano, mapaint ng hyperion dito. My mind is what you call hyperrealism. I'm going to go to for school project and for final exam. You look at Mary, no? I donated the pieces. A heart base. Oh, what is that? Hyperrealism. No, no, I don't need you. Acrylic. May kamay ka. No, no, no. Pag may kamay ka, continue. Remember, not everybody's blessed. Ito yung talent. But, it's given by God. Eh. Hindi naman gayon sa atin, it's given by God. So, use it to the fullest. How oh, I encourage people who are talent. At classmate, you can call the classmate part. You know how old he was? 83 when he started. Yan lang, unfortunately, namatay na siya at 2 or 3 years ago. So, ang galing ng kamay mo. So, you can't say na you're matanda, buto na mag-undi. Art does, walang age limit. Kung may talent ka, pursue it. Pursue that. You don't have to go full time like, I have a regular job. Kasi hindi mo pwedeng ano eh. Hindi mo pwedeng sabihin na you depend on art. Artists, you know, 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 you know,
Tapos gradually, they build up their name. At tiyaga sila. Ayan, may pangalan na sila. They command high price na. But when they started, my art patron, like I know there's this guy. He rents an apartment. Tapos, pinatira niya yung mga group of young artists. Ang problema, that guy took advantage of them. Ibig sabihin na, sige, ang, ang painting mo, ganyan lang, mukano lang. Tapos binabenta niya sa gallery, ganyan kalaki. Eh, ikaw, aangal ka ba? Umira ka sa apartment ko. Kahimig ka. So now, lahat sila, kumalas na. Pero, may pangalan na sila ngayon. So when you're starting, kailangan, ano ka? Isa pa. You should know who your friends are. Kahit sa art, rock mentality. Okay. Pag ano, don't believe everything that they say about you. Oh my God, 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 oh my God. Tapos sa likod mo, maraming ganyan. So katulad ako, I've been in the art scene, yung sabi mo, 2002 ako nag-start, 99, kamatay yung husband ko. So 2002 ako nag-join professionally. Up to now, nagbibilang mo, Wala nang close na close na ito. Wala pang tumpo. These people, I trust them. Pag sinabi nila, Mas, pangit yan. Dapat ito, dapat ito. I trust them. Niniwala ko. But, if it's, ano, yung, yung ibang tao, dapat ito, dapat ito. Pag niti sila, niti ka rin. Plastic ka. I think it, it's the same anywhere. It's the same anywhere. Check out. I don't know kung nasaan yung painting ko sa Merida. Isang babae. Malaki eh. They're 3 feet by 4 feet yata. Watercolor. Isang babae na parang nagka-harvest. Ay! Ay! Doon sa ano nila yun? Sa... Sa... Sa papunta sa... Ano eh? President yata eh. Oo. Papunta sa President uh -oh. yun. Nandun sa Merida. Di ba isang babae? I donated that sa 45th year ng high, uh, college. First time lang ako nag-attend ng reunion from college. Eh, ang pera namin, lahat we raised, we gave it to Sister Helen Gay Abbott. Eh, sabi ko, ano oh, yung school? Wala tayong nangibigay. Ay, bagla. Sabi ko, sige, I'll donate it to do you know Sister Helen? No, no. She was, she was our first theology teacher. She lives here in the Philippines. There is a bahay where all the Merino sisters live in Quezon City. After she, she took up a library. Kami na place ng pera para for her to take up the library. Sa, sa, ano dyan, sa that library, I donated one painting. Uh, glow of 72 hundreds. So, we can raise yung mga classmates ko. Ganun sila magano ng pera. Yung laki ng raise nila, ilan million siya ka, to put up that library. Pati yung mga garden, garden. Garden? Oo, oh, 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 ano. Okay, na. Okay, na.